What is a motorcycle? Two wheels, a motor, a seat, and a fearless driver on this seat. In rare cases, there is also a frightened passenger. Well, in the most rare cases, there is a sidecar in the recipe. Is this a motorcycle? What about trikes or ATVs? No, a motorcycle is, first of all, drive, a way of life, your own special style and format. Every motorcycle is an art of motor construction. Well, and every art has its own masterpieces. Amazing, stunning, even frightening. In every moto masterpiece, there is something that will make you regret that you are not its owner. Now, we will tell you about 12 motorcycles worth seeing at least once in your life. Among the most original moto masterpieces, there is a creation of the American designer Joey Ruther a motorcycle called Moto Undone. This two-wheeled wonder with an electric motor is similar to a device from a parallel universe. Square angular shapes and a reflective surface create the invisibility effect. Unfortunately, Moto Undone is just one-of-a-kind masterpiece of a single genius. Maybe someday motorcycles with a similar design will ride along our streets. But so far, it's just a worthy exhibit for the art museum. And so is the German designer, Frank Olli. This creative person has two passions, big motorcycles and non-standard technical solutions. Red Baron is a product of these two hobbies. Luxurious red chopper-type motorcycle with an aircraft engine with the capacity of 150 horsepower. Powerful, cool, and stylish. It is not difficult to guess that this moto masterpiece got its name from the colorful character of the times of the First World War. As a motorcycle is named, so it rides. This is folk wisdom, frozen in metal. Each masterpiece needs its genius. If such a statement is true, then Brazilian Tarso Marquis fits this role perfectly. A racer, a designer, a media star. And there is a motorcycle that fits such a person perfectly. Futuristic design, an abundance of chromium and carbon, everything in it is beautiful. Huge perpetual wheels look light and elegant, and the Rolls-Royce aircraft engine with a power of 300 horsepower is set so low that it hovers just about one inch above the ground. This motocross masterpiece is like a guest from the future or even an alien from another distant world. The motorcycle, TMC Dumont, is the embodied dream of Marquesh. If Marquesh is Leonardo da Vinci in the world of racing and motors, then Dumont is his Mona Lisa. By the way, this technological miracle is named after another Brazilian, an aviation genius, Alberto Santos Dumont, a dreamer and a technocrat. TMC Dumont is the embodiment of heaven. And this miracle of inventions is the embodiment of Earth, the Earth in all its motives. This motorcycle, made from a tractor, is a real Frankenstein of the world of technology. The engine is from the concrete mixer, the transmission is from the car, the wheels are from a mini tractor, and the hood is from another tractor. Only the frame is new, and it is welded from ordinary pipes. The other pieces of equipment that shared their rusty organs lived a long life and died without the right for resurrection. For many years, Larry Medwig of the American state of Ohio was simply collecting old rusty trash and, like a real genius, he breathed life into this trash. And what's the result? Brutal and surprisingly stylish motorcycle. Two-wheeled hero for the post-apocalyptic world. How does it ride? People ask Larry. Like a picnic table, the self-taught genius answers. A strange genius and a strange masterpiece. Both are characters for a movie. But the Philippine company Meep Incorporated is not afraid of going to the people. Their creation is the apotheosis of environmental friendliness. Extravagant bamboo electric motorcycle Green Falcon is a model that is ready to enter the market. Uh, bamboo? Yes! Body panels of Green Falcon are made of bamboo. As a result, the weight of the motor wonder is only 14 pounds. Despite the extreme lightness of the design, the two-layer bamboo shell of Green Falcon is stronger than steel. 
the motorcycle is capable of speeding up to 60 miles per hour, and the power reserve of its electric motor is 31 miles. The habitat of this beast is megacities of the near future. Even if Green Falcon does not become a serial model, this masterpiece will inspire other creators, because it cannot but inspire. And Boomerland Motorcycle is a live illustration of this statement. The only way to help yourself is to help others. The inventor, Albin Liebich, from the Republic of Czechoslovakia of the 1920s did not create a masterpiece to feed his ego. Liebich became famous for a whole range of incredibly cool motor monsters. Boomerland 1925 motorcycles beat three important records at once. The longest motorcycle in the world, with a total length of 8.8 .8 feet, the longest seat that is officially designed for three riders, the longest diameter of the wheel, 27 inches. This motocross masterpiece was being manufactured for 12 years. At that time, it was a dream of fan. Now, it is a dream of a collector. Unbeatable giant of the world of motorcycles, simply the giant. And for each giant, there is a midget. It weighs two and a half pounds, its speed is one mile per hour, and a Spirit's engine's capacity is 0.29 horsepower. It is not known whether Spirits participated in the development of this smallest motorcycle in the world, but Swedish enthusiast Tom Weiberg created a truly unique thing. Despite the tiny size, despite the lack of brakes and suspension, despite the ridicule of skeptics, Weiberg's invention is not a toy, but a motorcycle. The talented Swedish inventor was able to ride his creation for only 36 feet, but it was enough to immortalize himself in the Guinness Book of Records. However, spirits in the famous Book of Records are not the only ways to demonstrate your creativity. It is not known what French armorers drank in 1956, but this techno masterpiece has no analogs. We are talking about a scooter, Vespa 150 TAP, specially equipped to participate in the military operations of the Airborne Forces of France. Imagine a French Airborne who rides a motor scooter with a built-in protruding gun, and next to him, another airborne on a motor scooter with ammunition. Does it seem surreal? Nevertheless, at the end of the 50s, France had 800 such interesting vehicles. Naturally, the experiment was unsuccessful, but Vespa with the gun is forever among the most extravagant and unusual representatives of two-wheeled vehicles. And the Belarusian creator, Yuri Schiff, was inspired by the achievement of the Soviet cosmonaut Yuri Gagarin. The custom bike, named after the space pioneer, was presented at the exhibition Moto Spring 2016 in honor of the 55th anniversary of the famous flight. Brutal design, the inscription USSR and Red Stars. This motorcycle is an alien from the past, a night of retro romance. The complete opposite of this heroic brutality is the vehicle called Spira for You, created by the inventor Lon Ballard. Well, motorcycle is a subjective concept, and Spira for You is an illustration of such subjectivity. Polyurethane foam, bamboo, and fiberglass. Despite 490 pounds of weight, Spira can be taken for a toy. Softly, safely, sexually. This is a slogan that Lon Ballard chose for his moto artwork. Three wheels, one seat in the cabin, and a motorcycle steering wheel. Everything in it is unusual and compact. An unusual motorcycle for extraordinary people. But there is no limit to perfection. As the saying goes, we are all a bit strange, and motorcycles are like people. Some are less weird, some are more... Mm, Quantum Leap is one of the strangest motorcycles. No, it doesn't stand out for its cool futuristic design, although its design is worthy of a separate conversation. The strangest thing about Quantum Leap is that the leading wheel is the front wheel, and the guide wheel is the rear wheel motorcycle the other way around. And on top of this, Quantum Leap is the creation of a man who specializes in the design of cottages and restaurants. Eddie Meeks, of course, is familiar with the motorcycle business and was even engaged in it once. 
but the creation of ordinary strong motorcycles has always seemed like something trivial to him. Therefore, Meeks decided to create a motorcycle masterpiece with a spacecraft design and almost zero functionality. Quantum Leap looks stunning, but we probably should thank heavens that this vehicle does not ride around the streets. We can say the same about the motorcycle Black Pearl from the Dutch company Reva2 Customs. This company has long been engaged in creating unusual conceptual custom bikes, but there is no limit to originality. Combining a motorcycle and a steam locomotive? Is it easy? Well, maybe it's not easy, but for the inventors of Reva2, nothing is impossible. The result is a decent monster in a steampunk style. A monster with a real steam engine. A monster that is capable of accelerating to 6 miles per hour only six miles an hour? But even such a speed is incredible for an old steam engine. Simply a monster. This gigantic and powerful machine measures 30 feet in length, stands 10 feet high, and weighs nearly 14 tons. The Monster Motorbike is an Australian invention, created by famous stuntman Ray Bauman. The maverick inventor has treated crowds to amazing displays of its abilities, including crushing full-sized cars and even whole caravans beneath its wheels. A diesel truck engine gives the beastly machine its power. It took him three years to put the monster motorbike together. He admits that it's dangerous to drive it, but less risky than jumping over cars on a regular motorbike, which is what he used to do. Motorcycles are different. Scary, chic, amazing, cute, powerful. But each of them has something from the human soul.